Hello, and that was the transcription I did of April Wine's You Could Have Been a Lady that uh, Jim Clench uh, was the bass player on. And you can find that transcription at musento.com when you sign up for an intermediate bass lesson plan. Okay, Could Have Been a Lady, what a great, uh, what a great song, what a great bass line he came up with. It's a lot of fun to play. Um, I think what I'm going to do right now is I'm just going to play a, a couple of the parts for you. There's really only two parts. There's a chorus and a verse. And um, the original tempo was at 108 beats per minute. Uh, I'm going to demonstrate at 88 beats per minute. And I should point out that uh, the way I notated it, I, I tried to just notate what I, what I heard uh, within reason. Um, it's kind of one of those songs, it's a jam song, so I, I wouldn't be too concerned about playing uh, every exact rhythm that you see, but uh, you know, as an exercise, try to get close, why not, and play along to the record and, and here's, hear what he's doing. I might have missed some things or uh, added some extra things that weren't there, but um, anyway, just have fun with it, keep good time, and have a good sound, a good feel, and you can't go wrong with that. So right now this is going to be at uh, measure 5 and I'm going to play all the way up until the first verse and then I'll stop there. Two, three, four. Okay, next let's take a, take a look at the uh, the verse. Still the same chords, just the rhythm and the notes are a little slightly different. And again, this is going to be at 88 beats per minute. One, two, three, four. And that's pretty much the whole song. Just get the, uh, the arrangement right and uh, play along to the record and have some fun with it. And uh, that's it. I hope you enjoy. Don't forget, check out musento.com. And uh, thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.